friends. What's up, Pisces? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. We are going to do a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can be reversed. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, oh, you have options. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, so the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. This is kind of like avoiding the drama, like, and also a lot of like thinking, daydreamy, wishful, daydreams type energy there. Fantasizing. All right, so Pisces, what's coming up, please? We got the Four of Wands, the Strength card, Leo Energy. And the Nine of Pentacles. I love all the yellow here. That has to do with self-expression, creativity. You know, there is a lot of uh, self-growth here. But in general, there's a lot of stability here. The yellow is really, uh, really cool. It feels like some guards are coming down. All right, show me those four of wands, please, for Pisces. Hmm. You got the Two of Cups and the Magician. You're manifesting here. A lot of change, whether it's about moving in together, moving into a new house, moving to like the next phase. Things are kind of been wishy-washy there, but you are manifesting home, vacation, family, like the long-term mutual love. These are the biggies. So show me the strength card. For the obstacles. So this is Leo energy, but I mean, like I said, this is big stuff that you're manifesting over here. So I mean, it kind of makes sense that the strength card's there. You got the strength card and the emperor. Aries energy, you're a very powerful manifester. Tell me about this or this person coming in towards you, but it looks like there's been a lot of or there is a lot of anxiety around it. That's why it's coming in as the obstacle. Because somebody's trying to manifest home, marriage. Like I said, the long term, the biggies. And around the situation, it's interesting. Because somebody may be silent and really regretting that. But also somebody could be having financial issues. And, um, you know, kind of be feeling embarrassed and ashamed. Because you have, the emperor is over here stressing. But it does feel like this has something to do like within self. Damn. This person could be at a distance for sure or even silent. But like I said, this can go two ways. There could be financial issues there or somebody's really missing you. Like really missing you. Show me the Nine of Pentacles, please, for the outcome for Pisces. The Nine of Pentacles is good energy, especially if it's financially. Um, you got the Queen of Pentacles, the King of Cups. Finances could definitely be coming up if that's been the problem. But if not, um, tell me about this Queen of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles is a very loving, nurturing, caring type energy. But this is also a card of being, you know, financially independent, single, Kind of doing your thing so let's get energy for both of these show me the queen of pentacles first please there's some messages coming in there for some could be dealing with a virgo or an earth sign but they could be coming in online as well show me this king of cups so the king of cups can be your energy but also you know could be somebody that you're dealing with You got the devil. Capricorn energy. For some, this could be like a drinker. But um, the fact that the devil is there around this energy, 
Oh, you got the death card and the tower. Somebody's changing their ways. Whether it's, um, you know, monetarily or even drinking, like it can go a couple of ways, but this is like breaking bad habits, cutting something negative off there. I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time.